Hello everybody, welcome to the second round match. Uh, unfortunately a live one <laughs> between Krippy and Level Up. Uh, Krippy's Chaos Dwarves and Level Up's uh, Pro Elves. This is actually slightly, it's not live. The first about five or six turns will not be live uh, because we're catching up. In the booth with me is Eliod. Hello. Hello. I've got a, I've got a guilty secret. Uh, I, I prefer the live ones. Not, not to cast, you know. Don't get me wrong, but I actually enjoy watching the lives. I mean, depends if it's one I'm invested in, right? You know, if it's yes. uh, if it's one I don't really care about, then then no. But but for the ones that like, uh, it, it's two good coaches or something, or it's it's in my bracket or something, then uh, then yeah, I do enjoy the live ones. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? I, f I feel like the replays are better for YouTube. And, yeah, for sure. And I feel like if it's a good game. Yes, the live ones are good. The problem yeah. is when it's a really a not yeah, a good yeah. game and you're just like, oh my god, this is three hours of my life I won't get back. <laughs> yeah, it's completely fair. <laughs> There's just something a bit like, you know, exciting about like the live events. It's like real sports, you know, like I'm yeah. not interested at all in watching like a football game on a replay, but if there's a football game on live, well, yeah, sure, let's watch that. Yeah, yeah, it's funny, I'm exactly the same. Like, I've, I've ne oh my god, he's got a proper reroll in here. Right? Oh. Fail. Yeah, so perfect defense, nice start for the chuffs. Yes. Yeah, the nice. instant one. And that was like the only one. Like, you can fail all three of these. That was yeah. the only one he had to reroll. That was a bit unfortunate. I yeah, it was four was on code, wasn't it? Yeah. Maybe he needed two, but he only needed that one for sure. Oh, God, yeah, the shit birds game live would have been incredible. So, yeah, like, that's the thing. So, yeah, it's it's it's, it's just riskier, isn't it, watching them live? That's the yeah, thing. yeah, fair play. <laughs> it's the risk. And there's, also, there's a big payoff, but... <laughs> yeah. And also when there's up. 32 in a week, right? When there's 32 in a oh, week. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I do not want to watch any live. <laughs> yeah, I'm not I'm not suggesting, you know, anybody does cast them live for sure. <laughs> I do, do enjoy watching them. But Sometimes. I mean, I, I would have cast the Nick one live, you know, for sure, if it was on yeah. a more reasonable time. Yeah. Yeah. Um, because, yeah, I was hyped and I would do, I'd still stay up and watch it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is funny that about the. Uh, about sporting events, I always, I always want to watch sporting events live, and would never watch a replay of them. No, it's weird, isn't it? It's like it's the same thing, really. Like if you don't know the score, it's the same, but it's so uh, yeah. Wouldn't even watch it like delayed as well, you know? Like it's yeah, so yeah. No, so the elves have uh, some of the elves have buggered off here, and now now they're coming back. <laughs> yeah. It was just a ruse. <laughs> yeah, it's fair. Like I don't hate. There's kind of like a almost like a semi dacker kind of kind of kind of going on here. So I don't hate shoving some people up the pitch when you dacker as well, just try and get the the chores to sort of look around a bit. But they they've not cared at all about those elves, have they? And now the elves are in fact yeah coming back. Yeah. Glorious. No, I won't yeah, give pretty, in pretty, pretty cool, until actually. I'm victorious, and I will defend. Oh, we're going to go forward I will Oh, God, yeah, he is. He's going he's gonna to yeah. score. Is he? Oh, wow. The oh, yeah, doesn't it? Thank you very much for staying fantastic. Well, not becoming fantastic with Prime. <laughs> Glorious. Yeah, he's, he's just going for the score. The old two-turn. Oh, I guess stall, right? Just yeah, stall. It's top for turn, yeah. Stall for a turn. Wow. Or come back. Or come back. There is the possibility to just come back right from this. That's yeah. an interesting possibility. Got all the elves on this like one side pretty much, so uh, pretty strong over this right side, isn't he? Mm. Make a cage maybe next turn. Mm. Or a screen. Yeah, exactly, Kalon. Yeah, like I, I did what I like to be fair, I, I would have cast that live. Um and, and did watch it live. But it was basically guaranteed to be good, wasn't it? Whereas a lot of the games are not guaranteed to be good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. And, and like, you just get more invested in stuff, don't you? Like, if it's an Elliot game or a Rick game or whatever, then it gets a bit more spice to it than just two random, no offence to the random people of CCL, but, you know, if it's just two random coaches, it's just not as exciting as if it's, like, say... Elliot versus Rick, which I'd definitely watch that live even in the first round. I remember a random game in Chalice between Underworld and Vampires, and you looked at the Chalice draw and said, whoever wins, no one cares, because it was just two random shitters. And then one of them knocked out Ducky in the semi-finals, and, <laughs> and, and then lost like a shitter in the final. <laughs> and oh, no is that you? 
<laughs> yeah, yeah, I was me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, no, I just I thought it was funny. I thought it was funny. <laughs> I was like, I'll show them. <laughs> well, there you go. See, it worked I'll brilliant. Him, yeah, I right. created a monster. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. So it looks like the elves aren't coming back then, doesn't it? Mm. Taking lots of blocks kind of suggests that they're not really going to be able to cage up for anything here, are they? It's like a score. Yeah, it's like... Ages. And he, he did a good job of getting the bulls back and then leaving something fighting me so it wasn't easy for him to just move yeah. around and reconnect. Oh yeah, the die off face is brilliant for Creepy. That's, that's the best decision he's made with this Chaos Dwarf team, is the die off face. <laughs> Oh yeah, Nick when is I... a prisoner of Rick, isn't it? Whenever he's at AFK, he shows Nick's uh, house. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> like, well, you know, instead of having like the, the, the face cam showing an empty room, he shows like the face cam of like Rick's face cam when Rick was AFK one time. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> Yeah, he does that. I literally, like, I literally, I, I, I like, you know, I'd, uh, I'd, I'd, you know, just, like, left uh, someone else's stream on and they'd raided Rick. And Rick was AFK. And, I, and like, so his empty, his empty, but, like, room was on the screen. And I literally <laughs> thought it was Gadenic. <laughs> I just literally thought I was watching a Gadenic stream. Oh, man. <laughs> it's amazing. Glorious. So very early score there from Lord yeah. He doesn't have a wizard. Uh, no, not a fan really. Like he's got the move nine guy, but he's. Oh wait, no, is he? Yeah. So oh wait, is that? A... No, it's not on that, is he? He's no. a blitzer, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. blitzer move nine. Uh, he's got the he got the eighty seven though. He's trying to he's trying his hardest to be a catcher. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, he really is. <laughs> hey, Hancock. Um, Hello, but yeah, I mean, it's two two on grind territory, surely, and the Chorves are completely happy beating up spells for like. The next uh, 14 turns, aren't they? Yes, yeah, this is just a textbook 2 on grind now. Yeah. It could be unless something wild happens. Lovelop does have a bribe, which is a. Oh, wow. Very interesting inducement, isn't it? Yeah. I well, think the Apo, uh, usually, or Babes, I guess, to all Babes. Yeah. As, as the elves. Doesn't have a DP, does he? Mm. Yeah, it's an interesting one for the elves. Oh, okay. But he has defended against the Blitz. Pretty well. Here comes the Strength 4, big boy, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Strength 4 elves, pretty cool. It's really good, yeah. Ooh, and we one of them. Touch off tackle? No, he doesn't touch off. I don't guess it's not much movement left. Yeah. I guess it's kind of nice if you're flooding through to, to like have a tackle on the ball as well, right? Yeah. Although he does get just banged on by the ball instead, I suppose. Yeah, a little bit, because it is the tackle ball. <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah. Uh... So it's just instantly 2 d <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Which is not great. But still, you've you got to take risks, haven't you, really, at this stage? Like, you, you kind of set yourself up where you've got to take maximum advantage of any anything that goes your way, because, you know, the average game now, the Chorves win, right? Yeah. And this is this is a deep kick, and this is not yeah. this is not easy at all. No, like all those chorfs are not really going to be in range to do too much. Maybe maybe they can base up the elves a little bit, but the ball is going to be uh, you know slightly unprotected at least, surely. I, I quite like the plus movement on the uh, blitzers just because they've already got the sidestep, haven't they? So stats are just great on 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 poor blitzers. So I'd definitely yeah. Move. They don't get many good skills, do they? It's like dodge, tackle, yeah. <laughs> now what we're doing, diving, tackle. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Interesting that this guy's here instead of just out wider. Yeah, screening, right? Yeah. I was blitzing with the ball to get him back as well. That's nice, yeah. Yeah. Professional. Sensible. Yeah. Is he sideline caging or just no? Caging? It's 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 not the nicest. Like that DP is really in an odd spot, isn't he? It's yeah. uh, not the nicest screen at all. He's just staying behind. 
Ooh, but he can, he can just 3 plus 2, hey, can't he? Oh, no, sorry. F no, yeah, no, 3 plus 2. <laughs> but he's through tackle, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, 3 plus 2 through tackle. Yeah. Or 4 plus 3. Yeah, oh, yeah. Defending the ball is he's super gonna... easy. Oh, I, I, well, I think it might have to roll the dice there. I don't know. I guess we can put on a lot of pressure here, to be fair. Yeah, this is fair. You can jam all the elves onto the yeah, ball and stuff, can't you? Yeah, now it's 2 plus, isn't it? Now it's a 2 yeah. plus, which is really yeah, good. Yeah, this is all right. A lot of stuff through. Yeah, this is quite nice. Shame that big boy is uh, not really in range to uh, to do too much. Just yeah. sit on something, I guess. But yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot to come and tag. I mean, you've got. Unfortunately, now you've got to tag these mighty blow guys. I think. Like, yeah. Got, I mean, this mighty blow guy and this guard guy. I think you have to tag both of those out. Yeah. Looks like this might be a bit half man's. I think. Mm. Kind of got to go all in. I think. Yeah, I think so. As much as you don't want to. Yeah. I think you, you absolutely have to all man's here and just get everything. Yeah. Maybe he's left him a bit too responsive. Still, it's still tricky though, isn't it? Like, mm, you know, it is, it is. It's still tricky. There's still like elf columns here, essentially. Are we, we, we're dodging, I guess, doing a three plus dodge, are we? Mm. Are we? <laughs> like, uh, it's going to be hard to... Either that or we're staying in behind all these elves. Yeah, it's like... I'm it's sure just... we have to dodge. Mm, There's just no way to... Oh, no, we can't clear it. Am I being... Oh, no, no, we can't. There's another elf there. <laughs> Oof. Wait, what was... Whoa, what was... what was this? Oh, what... wait, no, what was this? <laughs> it was Whoa. just fishing for a pan. And then what? double oh. dodging. Oh, no, sorry. He was based, wasn't he? Oh, sorry. No, never mind. That, that was fine, wasn't it? Yeah. And he's failed the dodge? Oh my god. No, I think that was right though, wasn't it? I, I did realise yeah. he was already placed, yeah. You, because with a bull, you'd have to, like, you'd have to double dodge, right, to get the bull. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I was talking about the dodge through the, uh, the the second dodge he just made. I didn't even realise there was a first dodge. <laughs> right. Yeah. I, I guess just to try, try and power that guy and then the one dodge, yeah. Or the two dodges. I mean, I don't like diving tackle red hair. With the movement, I would have gone tackle rather than... Diving tackle, but yeah, he's, look, look, the elves have got the ball, and now, yeah, uh, and now the early score looks brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Laughing in the face of the two-one grind. Yeah, I guess that's the thing about the elves, isn't it? Like when things do happen, they are there to take advantage, right? And uh, mo most of the time, they don't happen, you know, and they get two <laughs> grounds. But if anything goes wrong, then they're more, much more able to take care of it than the uh, take advantage of it than the bash teams, aren't they? Yes. I don't know, I don't know. I mean, I think, I, I hate the sprint on him. I hate the sprint on him, but I, I would have definitely taken double move up. Would I? I would have definitely taken the first one. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I'm, if you've taken the first one, though, you, you've got to take the second one, surely. <laughs> yeah, probably. And then tackle. Like, you'd rather yeah. have the other stats, though, wouldn't you? would rather have strength and agile. I mean, holy yeah, mother. it's it's the worst stat for Blitz, isn't it? But yeah. still, yeah, I agree. They just don't get too much, do they? Like, I guess, well, there's an argument. Like, if, if you're building long term, then you take the move right. There's an argument that dodge wins you more, like, when you take it, doesn't it? You know, dodge is probably, well, dodge is definitely much better for the team, I think, isn't it? Yeah. At, at that level, you know, when he's just leveled up. Yeah. Yeah, so, so, so if anything, you would go dodge, tackle then move yeah maybe yeah and yeah. then diamond tackle was pro probably been the optimal progression for him yeah if all you want to do is win each game at a time yeah but now i mean now now like the chores have lost right like it's not over Whoa. But it's not over but this is when i say they've lost because now that like that's that's the inevitability of the match right isn't it like that's what's happened that's what's yeah. happening they have to change this like Unless yeah. they change it massively. Like, that's what I mean. I don't mean they have lost already. <laughs> yeah, but that's that's what you said. I mean, yes. The, the, the Chores are very likely to lose, but that's not the same as the Chores have lost, right? <laughs> well, yes, but what I'm saying when I say is they've lost is that this is like the, the inevitable, you know, 
game state that we're marching towards. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, I but I can't say that every time. <laughs> no, all right. <laughs> and, <laughs> and, you know, you like... You could say the Chiefs are losing. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, like, but they were winning after the early score, right? Even though they were 1-0 down. Oh, yeah, absolutely agreed. Be because that, that then the inevitability was with them. They were going to 2-1 grind it out. So yeah, it was a sure. great situation for them at first, but now it's a horrendous situation for them. So, so had the Chorves won a few turns ago, and now the Chorves have lost? Yeah, yeah, basically. Okay. <laughs> it's a very weird way to use the English language. <laughs> <laughs> way. Nobody said I could speak English, Elliot. <laughs> <laughs> Who can? What a fucked language. <laughs> Ooh, is he in range? Sure oh, not. but he'd already oh, no, he's blitzed. blitzed already. Yeah, he'd already blitzed, already, yeah, yeah. but he can base. Yeah, that's fair, I guess. Could get surfed as well now. Oh, uh, yeah. I guess, like, do you even, like, want to play around here as the elves, though? Like, because you are so in charge now, do you just bang it in? I, I guess you, you don't want to bang it in, though, do you? Because then it's... Because if the elves do bang it in, then it's, you know, short drive for the chorfs, 2-1 after the elf drive, and, and the chorfs are backing it for the 2-2, two -two, aren't they, in overtime? Exactly, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. we don't want to uh, stall this, don't you? Little yeah, bit. absolutely want to stall, yeah. <laughs> exactly, screw. We don't get taught half of the things. That no, Germans we do not. Taught. It's ridiculous. No, it's it's so bad. Like, there's so much to know about language, like about the English language, like all yeah. this, all this stuff. And, but <laughs> I don't know any of it. I, yeah, I yeah. listened during school. I'm, I, I, I listened pretty well. <laughs> <laughs> it's stupid. We just literally just don't get taught that. It was hilarious. It was hilarious when I was in Germany, you know, and like saying, "What about this with the grammar and stuff?" And I'm like, "I don't know. We just didn't get taught that." Yeah, <laughs> got no idea. <laughs> Literally never got taught it. Well, I would not go that far, Jay has it. <laughs> I don't know much about C plus plus either, sadly. <laughs> you could write a book about the things I don't know about. I mean, you could with everybody. Like, yeah, it's insane yeah, how much sure. everybody doesn't know. I know, right? Wow. But, I mean, this is a lot of two pluses off tackle or just without dodge. So maybe, oh, yeah, like, Guardman do doesn't have dodge, does he? Yeah. Or... Maybe no, maybe. it's 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 only one two plus to free the ball, right? A two plus and a blitz to, to, to blitz off the ball. Yeah. And then, if you've used the reroll, okay, then maybe you bang it in. But if not, I I think you've got to I think you've got to try and stall it three turns. I don't know. You can stop me in three turns though, can't you? To be fair, yeah, it's not that long. I guess you you do you definitely do the dodge from the guard, or well, or somebody yes. else. You you do the guard from somebody. Maybe yeah, he's not yeah. the guard. Or why he's just one being. Well, I hate that. Ooh, wow. I think that's definitely wrong because yeah. It's it's like uh, yeah yeah. Oh man, the stun though. That's um... the stun's incredible. Now now you probably plus, do. Plus stall. <laughs> yeah, now you probably do stall, all right. <laughs> I wonder if you just stick this diving tackle man on the ball and then dodge the others out to screen, yeah. or make the diving tackle man part of the screen. Yeah, that's that is nice, isn't it? Because what else can get yeah. there? This strength. Yeah, can get exactly. There, which is, sucks. Yeah, he is tagged at the moment though, right? So you could leave the. Uh, not leave the move nine guy dodge out till a bit later. I mean, yeah. you can dodge him, of course. So. And you can just put that guy there. Yeah, that's that's actually pretty sick. Putting the diamond, I like that a lot, Elliot. Yeah, stick him on there. Yeah, that's really nice. Really nice. <laughs> Bang it in and get another blitz. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Bang it in and get another blitz. Yeah, I mean that. God, blitzers are stupid, aren't they? Oh, it's, it's, and especially the bang it in and get a blitz. It's so the worst feeling. You're like, okay, so you've chosen to lose. Oh, wait, I'm fucked. <laughs> <laughs> You're reaching guys. Yeah. Yep, that is exactly how it goes. Okay, so he doesn't do that. I mean, it's 1 2 plus, and it's pretty much safe, isn't it, to be fair? Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. But yeah, maybe maybe doing it your way was better. Maybe I, I who knows? It's a pretty close one. I, th hey, I, Nick, I really like your way. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> me too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hello, good day, Nick. We've already done the replay of your game. Congrats. Well played. 
I like Gadernik. Yeah, I think I think that is the way. Like after the reroll gone, yeah, stick him on there. Yeah, I like that. And he just scores. Oh, yeah. I mean, you know. <laughs> yeah, that's it's, it's 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 pretty close. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's pretty close, isn't it? So it's always I find it difficult to you know estimate like scoring chances. You know, like when you think about whether to stall or not, it's. I find it difficult to say, you know, what what is the likelihood that these dwarfs will make this touchdown right like, you now? How yeah. just exactly where do I place scoring versus versus stalling? Yeah. They're uh, twenty three and a half percent to score. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> I didn't see, didn't hear you come in uh, Dio. Nice to nice to talk to you. Been a, <laughs> been a, been a, been a while since I've seen. <laughs> well, that's it. You've got to work it out, haven't you? Like, you've, you've got to. You have like he's Dio's right. Like you, you should oh, yeah. pick a number. You should just well, assign an equity value. Yeah, then... I mean, you you can estimate, right? I, yeah. I I understand sort of where you go with it. Sometimes, yeah, you know, with 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 the joking about it, with him being like. So, Sometimes it feels like he's being much more precise than he can be. I guess. <laughs> yes. Yeah. It's but but, <laughs> but he, 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 like, you are right, and he is right, and you know it, it's really good, and it's good practice as well, right, to kind of try and estimate things. Yeah. Hello, HTK. Because at the end of the day, you know the chance of you failing that stall, which is you know one in six. Yes, right? exactly. So, so eighty-three percent of the time, you're looking pretty good. Um. Right, right, yeah. So you probably should stall there, and especially with the diamond tackle. That that was super nice. Now that was that was. I'm sure that was the answer. Yeah, I didn't even think of that either. I would have just like thought about. Well, I wouldn't have made the one D. So yeah, yeah, different. yeah. It's weird. With two rerolls versus none, that definitely increases the chance of scoring, doesn't it? So, yes, and all the tackle as well. Um, yeah. Especially on like the turn eight, the elves are probably going to be based a bit by the chorfs. Oh, but he does have kick. Ooh. All right. Well, that that's that's plus plus to scoring, then, isn't it? Yeah. Pete Diddy, though, that's oh, against. Oh, that's a great, great score. A great score. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, the stun. Yeah, the stun had to swing the odds massively in your favour, right? At the stall. Yeah. Without the stun, then uh, then your diamond tackle has to stay on that ball. Yeah, yeah. And and so I think without the stun, you, without the stun, I think you almost certainly score there. Yeah, with, with the reroll gone as well, for yeah, sure. Yeah. If you still have the reroll, well, maybe you just try and make a, a nice screen, but yeah, no reroll is pretty scary. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. The elves have taken no damage, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> two and a Holy moly! Because it's not like it's not a soft chaos team, is it? Like this is okay. It's not as it's not as good as it could be. There's there's two only guard chaffs. There's a mighty blow one, like three up ones with only mighty blow and one full claw on it. But like, it's not a so like it's not a soft no. team, is it? Four no. mighties. That's it's kind of crazy that they've taken nothing yet. Well, that was the thing though, Fluffy, wasn't it? Because because there was like the instant pressure with the yeah. blitz and that, he just wasn't able to. I mean, it's, it's, elves are elves are so good, aren't they? When they stay on the pitch, it's pretty it's pretty outrageous. Yeah. <laughs> if you could keep a full elf team around, yeah, that's the thing. Like it just snowballs both ways, doesn't it? Like the yeah. longer that yeah. they can they can keep your ball under pressure, you can't pile on indiscriminately. You've got to blitz people to the up like positionally, and so you can't attrition blitz and everything. But then by the same token, if if you get on top of them like like uh, Gadenik did, then all of a sudden you're getting loads of hits and like loads of pylons and fouls, and it's horrendous for them. <laughs> yeah, it it almost feels like there needs to be like kind of a comeback mechanism in Blood Bowl, you know? Like, it, this, things do snowball so much, right? And I guess that's that's not great there. You know, th th things are GG, aren't they? But they, they shouldn't be GG, you know? There, <laughs> there should, be a, it should be a bit more kind of like, the, the, the better you do, the harder it is to do more better instead of the better you do, the easier it is to do more better as it, as it is now. Yes, yeah, that, that's... And that's always been a problem with Games Workshop games, honestly. Like, really? Yeah, yeah fair. It's always been... And it, it just naturally happens, right? Like when, It does, when yeah. You, when, when you think, like, Games Workshop games have always been, like, tabletop games played in, like, small leagues and stuff. So they're not really designed for anybody to be as good as Elliot. But, um, you know, in, even in a group of friends, somebody's going to be the best. 
and sure. they're going to make all the best decisions and they're going to score the most touchdowns and they're going to get the most star player points and they're going to level their players up better yeah and then so they're just going to pull further and further away and like it was the same with Mordheim and everything like you know uh, Necromunda the, the, the best players you know leveled their guys up more got more money got better gangs and then had an even bigger advantage for every game and, and so every, every game like that has been snowball-y fair TBH yeah, and like forty k in Warhammer, whoever gets the first turn is just has a massive, massive advantage. Really? That, this, <laughs> that you know, and like it's hard to, it's it's such a huge advantage going first. Like although they've come up with various things to try and help stop it, it's like it's a huge thing that they've got to deal with. Like from a yeah design standpoint, isn't it? Is how do you let people come back? So like with forty k, they had like objectives. So whoever had the last turn would like could grab objectives. So like that was a pretty uh, cool okay. advantage that they would have. Yeah. But like it's hard it's dead hard to like do a thing to make it so that you get that kind of thing. It it, it is hard. <laughs> it seems like <laughs> they don't try that hard to <laughs> to fix it. <laughs> True. True. Yeah, but sure I did like it's it's completely like a, a difficult skill design in games and stuff, isn't it for sure. Yeah. Yeah, because you, 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 you want to, you want you want like you want to reward the people that scored the touchdowns and won the yeah. games and, and everything as well, yeah. right? So it, like... It's natural. The snowball is natural, isn't it? Yeah. But it, does it? You know, is it the best thing? You know, for for competitive games and Spending stuff. Spending the ball know, is super. Easy. Oh, that's rough. Eat it. You can't eat it. Funny, he could have put the the hobgoat hobble here, right? If he puts the hobble here and the other hobble there, he can eat that dub skull. Not saying yeah. he'd want to. Has but... he picked the ball up yet? No. Okay, no. maybe he should have maybe picked the map, but then he's... No, nah, I... Yeah. It's, yeah, I, I think you kind of got to reroll it anyway, right? Just because you want to get that ball picked up. It sucks so much. Yeah. Well, having the hobo stuck back there. And it, and it is fair enough taking the block first, I think. It's, you know, it's yeah. only double scores. And you've got a high roll a bit at this point anyway. Yeah, true. True, true. I don't like letting this guy out. Um, yeah. Really is that other hobo going to, like, cover it? I guess he does now, now that you've picked it up and you move here, then you move him over, don't you? Or you just tag, it's not quite time for 136. You've got a, like here or here, right? Yeah. Probably. I think, like, one, I think, like, in your, yeah, where he is now, but where you're pointing your mouse, you know, like, <laughs> in, in the opposition half, yeah, just so yeah. he's in range, you know. Yeah, 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 that's a good shout, yeah, good shout. And yep, Irish rounder. I say that all the time, but it's it's still tricky. Like it's still tricky, right? And if you make, a, if you make like, that's why I didn't mind them making kind of stars a bit too good because I'm okay with that because you still get to reward the people who make you know people with making their teams better. But then by making the inducements super powerful, then at least you give those players that have fallen behind a bit of a you know like that becomes yeah. the, the comeback mechanic in in a way. It's like everyone hates like spinning somebody four hundred TV down, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's interesting. It, it is interesting because, like, like, like you say, you know, there's there's kind of a, a a bit of a dichotomy between people complaining about, you know, you know how as as well in the new rules without redraft about how powerful the big teams will be, but also inducements are really powerful. So you know, I guess I guess the teams in the middle are just gonna get sandwiched. Yeah, you get either massive or tiny. Yeah, yeah. You're either you're either nine hundred TV dwarves, or, or yeah. you're like four thousand TV elves. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, min max notlings. Oh good. yeah, incredible! Like outrageously good. Like one of the best teams in the game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was looking at making a a min max vampire team on Fumble for these Royal Rookie Rumble things, uh, but I was devastated to find out they they can't get Morgan Thorg. They're quite limited in their. Uh, like they're star players because they're one of the undead teams. You so, could do yeah, the same what? with Chorth, right? You could have a bull and and ten uh, hobbles and yeah. Morg. <laughs> yeah. Or um, ha oh yeah, Hackflem, yeah, Hackflem yeah. and Morg. <laughs> <laughs> That's like sadly all the best rosters of like all the shit teams, right? Nurgle would just be like ten, well, eleven rotters and stars, and and like Burts will be like probably. A blitzer and ten peasants and stars yeah. and stuff like that. Like all of the teams are just like old, old world alliance, human linemen and stars. <laughs> yeah, uh, I, I did old world alliance. Like it was. I think I. I think I got a blitzer or a couple of blitzers, but and then a deep boot. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, yeah, I, I had the tree man and deep view. Yeah, that was it. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, flicky flack. Yeah, hack for on show off. Yeah, that's... Are we are we over committing a little bit to this bullet down? That seems Three a elves. lot. Yeah, for an edge four mm. guy, an edge two guy, and you've got two edge threes here to worry about. Yeah. I guess like if if you just had those two bracketing it, he could like blitz himself out or something, but mm. so he does seem like a lot. I guess he hasn't got tackle, right? So you can reposition these guys afterwards. But I would maybe rather have the diving tackle over here and the move nine over there. It would be a lot better, wouldn't it? Like I don't know where they started. Yeah. Or if so if it was possible or not. But if you have the diamond tackle over here and move nine over, that's so much better because then move nine can just go wherever it needs to. Next yeah, time. it's good, isn't it? You, you put your fast players on the outskirts because they can get back in, can't they? Yeah. Yeah, dwarves with Griff. Yeah, like just dwarves. Just dwarves in general, right? They're just they're disgusting. You have 11 players for 800 TV. There's your team. <laughs> just there's your team. Yeah, pretty crazy. I won't have rerolls or anything, thank you very much. And let's see what let's see what I face. <laughs> <laughs> and now oh I'll have Griff. Okay. <laughs> Looks like I don't need rerolls. <laughs> uh quick score and a blitz Veron. Um two turn and a and a blitz by the elves. Yep. Or oh, a three turn maybe. Yeah, three turn, yeah. A chorf hack flem win a tawny game eight nil. Boy howdy. I've never won eight nil. I was gonna win eight nil, but somebody quit and never played oh. on Fumble ever again. <laughs> wow. Well, <laughs> fair play. <laughs> it was a dicing. It wasn't like he was the worst player ever. It was just an yeah. absolute dicing. I just killed all of his team and stuff. <laughs> it was ridiculous. It was just the worst dicing ever. <laughs> if you are gonna do an early GG, then never ever playing on the platform again is it? Yeah, I think that's that's acceptable GG. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I mean, it, like, and the funny thing is, this bull's still a scoring threat, right? Like, yeah. Even, even though he's got these three people around him. I guess if he gets powered, he's not the right one to the yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I would, I, I would go like, I would, I would just have a full team, like not necessarily long beards. That you can still have two blitzers and a runner, but it's still like, it's still nothing, is it? It's still like eight hundred and five TV for that team. Yeah, and then you can just get you can induce re rolls if you need them or you know whatever just depending on how far how far you behind and yeah rando guards why not rando skills are pretty good yeah quick and cheap fire them if you uh, if they don't roll anything good yeah <laughs> put, put a Dio rolled three pile drivers yeah. on his fumble dwarf team. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, he, he, I think he like he rolled a guard first as well, right? So it's like, oh, this is amazing! I've got a guard. <laughs> Just like pile driver, pile driver, pile driver. <laughs> and he never played Blood Bowl again. <laughs> oh dear. This this hobble's got to go somewhere, hasn't he? Because at the moment, mm. this hobble. I wonder where he is going. So but why is not he in range? This is this is primary primary scoring threat now, isn't it? Or is he going to GFI, maybe? That's why he hasn't moved him yet. This Chorf could double GFI attack, but that, that's a sick double GFI. Ooh, it is, yeah. yeah or he could go GFI into there, which is also sick, because that's stopping two two pluses off. Yeah, so I, I, I do like backing up that ball, though. That is cool. Yeah, yeah. But it's just scary, isn't it? The one reroll, such a rough reroll on turn, uh, turn six. Yeah. You'd love to be all those GFIs in. Maybe you just move the ball up, move the hobble up, and then yeah, and then go for the GFIs. You have to do the and if you fail, you fail. Because you have to have the reroll on the last turn, right? You just have to. Yeah, exactly, exactly, yeah. It looks like you'll have a chance with this bull anyway, so I, I would put him in yep. hand off range of the bull. Yeah, I guess you're, you're maybe you're thinking about you know, where does the ball go because the elves can come through for the ball, can't they? But yeah. to some extent, you have to think. Well, if they roll those three pluses and stuff and get the power, well, you know, then then that's it. I've still got to set up to try and score next turn. <laughs> yeah, I think he is good, right? Because 
This guy's got a 3 plus to there. So if you go here, he, he then doesn't have a 2 plus after it. Yeah, so he's. Yeah, so, one so to it, the left. Yeah. yeah, so if you. Or. Two. Two to the left. If you're two to the yeah, left, then he's got left, a three yeah, yeah. and then has to do another three, whereas now he's got a three, two, two. It's not, it's only a little bit better. Yeah, though, that's fair, right, yeah. And I guess you're more central here as well, which is nice for like the other ball potentially. Yeah. Ah, so he's, he's got guards. Guards either side of the hobble. Okay, that's, that's cool. That's pretty good. Yeah. yeah, just yours, Nick. Just yours. And then this one. <laughs> and then after Monday Night Claw, or before Monday Night Claw, there will be the other one, which um, is. You give me a moment. Oh, he hits with a wrestle. Ooh, but now he's in I mean, he's not likely to be the best <laughs> choice, but he is in range. <laughs> he is in range, yeah. He is in range, but then that allows him to move the blood step DT somewhere. That's fair, that's fair yeah. Uh, we've got Martin Septim versus Augmented Beard, which is just kicking off right now. Oh, nice. So we could do the replay of that potentially uh, before Claw. I'll probably uh, call it a day after this one. Fair enough. Thank you very much. For, uh, coming no worries. Speed. It's been just eating my tea and I uh, saw so Jimmy was streaming. I thought, oh, it sounded all alone and sad. And <laughs> I, <laughs> oh, <laughs> popping. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Glorious. Yeah, there's no real. There's no real play on this hobble, is there? No, like, no. I was thinking and... double chain with a frenzy man, but the the stand firm guy is on like the correct side, yeah. so we can't put him. And it would be hard anyway with him being on the floor. Yeah, yeah. This is tricky. Maybe the best bet was the the three two two to one D the ball or something. Yeah, maybe. Because I don't see an obvious blitz that's really helping you. I guess you could just like dodge the guard in and, and one D him, try and knock him down. Maybe you park the diving tackle man on the bull and then one D the hobo, take the four plus. Oh, there's no real, there was, that's a bit sad. Yeah. He's still got one lateral square, so like this isn't. Yeah. Yeah. Good enough at stopping him. He does have dodge on this guy, so this is the only guy who's relatively free. Yeah. Everyone else is stuck on tackle. Maybe maybe blitz him and then sidestep on the hobo, right? One D blitz and then stick sidestep oh, yeah. on the hobo. Yeah. It's not good though, is it? I don't think there's a good no. player. <laughs> I don't think there's a good play anywhere. I mean well so I guess what you could do is you could you could stick the blood step in front of him, you could dodge the guard out, put him there, and then he could go one, two, three, four, five, GFI, GFI and hit him. I guess oh, Okay. That's the sensible play. Oh yeah, this is nice, isn't it? Then he gets the two plus to base with strength four. Yeah, that's fair. That's nice pretty cool. Good. And it's not even that easy to free these chores up to uh, to hit him. No, uh, exactly. And yeah, if he hits that sidestep uh, move nine guy with a bull. He can actually move to block the hobo path as well, can't he? Yes. He can sidestep to block the hobo path, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. This is but <laughs> if he KOs him. <laughs> <laughs> and he got, the, he got this extra one on as well. Oh, yeah, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, that's pretty cool. Yeah. She can't, certainly can't blitz out. <laughs> no. But you can, you can blitz him free, right? So you can. Yeah. But then you're going to have to dodge. With the hob or whatever happens, you're gonna have to dodge with somebody. Yeah, yeah. And if you blitz him, then you don't have to dodge with the uh, hobo at all. So maybe you blitz, but then he can't. He can't make a four three. So you have to. No, blitz him. yeah. Just do two three pluses. Yeah, you have to blitz him. And the handoff. And then handoff, and then dodge with him as well. Either way. Yeah, this is the claw one, wasn't it? So he's got this guy and this guy to deal with him. 
Uh, I guess there's a uh, GFI here as well. One, two, three, four, five, GFI. six GFI, yep. And double GFI from the hobble. Yeah, a lot of dice. A lot of dice. Of course, some coaches would <laughs> would think this was the easiest score they've ever seen in their life. <laughs> That's true, yeah. <laughs> For some, it would be. <laughs> For some blood ball coaches, this would be a Monday. So, uh, Vic, doing claw with you tonight? Yes, yes. Almost certainly. I don't think nice. there's been any drama. Drama? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, there was there was drama last week, right? He was. Uh, oh, really? He was. Yeah, like he had he had uh, he had things like with uh, like you know family stuff that. Uh, ah, okay, I, fair. I saw that brewing, so I I got I got two replacements in. So that, uh, ah, okay, nice. He could forget about claws. I guess it's okay to do. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, and then... Oh, he hit this guy. Yeah, he might as well hit him, because yeah. he can go yeah, the other way. Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So there's no... and he, But he, he still blocks it anyway, unless, unless you yeah. KO him, yeah. But it doesn't yeah. matter if he blocks it, because you just go the other way. Yeah. Yeah, so you always take that hit. Oh! Huh. Hello! Champ! What's going on? <laughs> hey! You got a job, Dimmy. I've Hello. been so... <laughs> Hello, oh. Dimmy. Hello, Jimmy. You alright? Yeah, I'm alright. How are you? Yeah, not too bad, mate. Are you cheating on me? <laughs> <laughs> Who? Fuck off, Jimmy. Hey! <laughs> well, yeah, both of you. <laughs> <laughs> Glorious. How are you guys doing tonight? Are you good? Yeah, good, thanks yourself. Yeah, not too bad, mate. Just finish work, aren't I? Nice. So... Is it... Monday, oh, he went through the diamond tackle! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> well, yeah, five two or three two two. You, which yeah. is better? You decide. <laughs> wow, that was that was wild, wasn't it? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> well, I mean, if you roll the five straight away, then that one's better, obviously. Way. Yeah. Yeah. It's obviously, obviously the right move. Great play. Yeah, Stop two, beating. five, six. Next roll could have been a one, right? <laughs> Saw the dice. Yeah. <sighs> wow. Are we are we gonna add another conspiracy on top of the? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, creepy is Spanish. Maybe maybe they have access to the dice now. <laughs> um. No, those, that's the French, isn't it? It's the French that have the uh, the better dice. It's, yeah, the French. The French are the <laughs> were the the, the first one. <laughs> Just a joke, by the way, everybody. Just yeah, a joke. Of course. You Just can't tell. So, wow, this makes it so there could be overtime. Very real chance of overtime. No Kaz random cast chore, sadly. <laughs> mm, nothing. Like, just don't, no damage. A KO'd Lino. Yeah. It's like it's crazy. Three mighty blow and a pom, and like you know, six tackle, seven tackle, and a DP, two DPs. I mean, he hasn't really fouled, but still, like it's kind of crazy still to have just done nothing. This is very open. This side's very open, isn't mm. it? and this side. Yeah, it doesn't need to be at this point, does it? No, it's not like a short drive or anything. It's. Uh... I, I guess this is the thing, right? Like he's got a bunch of people back. Like I, I prefer the wider ones, but he's, yeah. he's kind of gone with more people back to respond. I guess the, the bull and the extra hobo. Maybe I mean he's not finished yet. I guess either. And he has but, got kick, right? So maybe he thinks he's gonna kick it deep. Yeah, it deep yeah. Last time, so he just wants stuff back. Yeah. Yeah. Deal that, if it comes, and he does kick deep. That goddamn psychological kick warfare. <laughs> <laughs> Throw a rock. Oh. Again, no injuries allowed. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Yeti, I just don't work on Tuesdays, Yeti, so Monday's always a great day for me. <clears throat> yeah. 
I think the elves induced a bribe uh, scroll because because the chorfs didn't have one when I checked. So like, and like I checked pretty early in the match. So I do believe. Yeah. Yeah, uh, that the elves took a bribe over an apple. He does have a dirty player. Oh, he does. On, he's uh, put him on the LOS though. <laughs> I missed him earlier on. Yeah. Okay, that makes a lot more sense then. Yeah, and he's got two niggles on he creepy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. good point. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Right. Which kind of kind of makes the the foully foul high roll a little yeah. bit better. And it but disincentivizes the pylagons. Yeah. 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 I too would not put my DP on the LOS if I had a bribe. No. <laughs> so. I guess I'd put my thrower on the sure hands guy. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. I wouldn't even have a thrower, but that's me. <laughs> They're okay, though, right? For, for, with pro elves, it's only 10k. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah it, I know, it's I know. the starting board really well as well. Mm. You just pick one up instead of a lino in the normal starting board. Yeah. Though not in the new edition of the rules. Uh, oh, mate, that really threw me. Um, yeah. Uh, you get because like even like the 5k changes, and you're like, what? <laughs> Oh, finally a Kaz! Apple it. Boo. Would you? No, oh, no, I'm just oh, kidding because we've, we've not had any Kaz so far. <laughs> Is this the first game you've done? Uh, we did seven. a replay. Oh, we did the Canadian game. Oh, is this live? This isn't live. This, this is, is live, live. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. We, the first about got... the first five or six games were were replay, and then it's just to fill time before Corsi. <laughs> it was this or play Dwarves, <laughs> and Elliot made the executive decision to watch a, to watch a live game instead. <laughs> I, I would I would have to agree with you on that one, Jim. <laughs> it's a solid decision. <laughs> Well, gets the pick up. Yeah, I've played Creepy. Creepy plays like pretty quickly, to be fair. I've played him a few times, I think. Yeah, I played. I, there was a streak I went on. I played him like every season about five times. Yeah, <laughs> I remember. He, he was normally Chaos, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's them siestas, isn't it? Them Spanish siestas. <laughs> so they have the daytime to themselves, and then obviously that's Elliot time. <laughs> How sick is this, by the way? If, if if this was Blood Bowl 2020, he'd have three defensive assists. Oh, yeah. <laughs> whatever happened. Pretty cool. Yeah, because God needed a buff. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> well, there's still more creepy in the top ten. No. Lots of chunter. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, Spartaco is the best one. Not, it's not Spartaco. It is Spartaco, isn't it? I'm like this. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Spartaco. Yeah. Not Spartaco. So yeah. Yeah. Uh, with, with the the Agi Five <laughs> Bob Goblin. Yeah. <laughs> the Elliot <laughs> got abused by. Yeah. Um, and some kind of Super Bowl as right as well, right? So the the ball was special in some way. But yeah, with the Agi Five goddamn Hobo was. <laughs> And he kept getting a wizard against any other, just wizarded, uh, like leaping in with this anti fire pop goblin and <laughs> running off. <laughs> I, I was playing like chaos or something. Like there was nothing I could do. He just bolted me, grabbed the ball, lobbed it. Like what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Balls to the wall here by Love and Love. Yeah. This is another. Yes, the DP as well, guys. Nice. Yeah. Oh, and he's completely separated. Yeah. Well, yeah, he'll be able to sneak down the sideline, yeah, Roni. Maybe you could hold the extreme edge with a sidestep, right? Yes, That's really yes. Yeah, yeah, I would. Yeah, no, he's not. I, I guess, really, he should have maybe thought it through a bit more and, like, shuffled, like, one extra elf over so they could hold the edge with a sidestepper and then still have a two a two screen where the sidestepper currently is. Yes, yeah. I don't like the... Like, I love the way he's put his, like, near natty... Is that a near natty? That's a near, near natty, 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 yeah. Spring, yeah. yeah. I love the way he's put him at the back of the screen to protect him, but there's a whole <laughs> line of chores <laughs> with Corpom behind him. Like. Yeah. I guess he has to blitz one of the corner elves, though, right? Like, maybe the dodge guy behind oh, the sidestepper. Yeah, he can't yeah. sideline, can he? No, 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 I can't sideline. I don't know, like... You see GFI once and, you, and you're good. Yeah. That's what I think. Yeah, you, you could even just jam in... Jam into the uh, like put, put two guys on the sidestep uh, on the DT. Guy yeah, line. that's what I was thinking. Might not yeah. need the GFI. 
Yeah. But maybe you might leave something on then. Yeah, that's the problem, isn't it? But, uh... I, I think you've just got enough to make it safe, though. You should have enough players around there. Yeah, fair. Probably wouldn't have put the Ark in that square though if I was gonna do that. Uh, if I was gonna do that, I would have I would have blitzed him right and then moved and then put the stand firm there because he could just uphill you pretty easily now. Can't he? Yeah. Uh, yeah, he can go there. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. I guess I was thinking he had to stand there, but standing here is pretty. You don't have to GFID. No, that's, yeah, that's fine. That's probably fine. And he's got the fend as well. What a legend. Oh yeah, I was thinking, hmm, frenzy man. <laughs> but yeah, uh, Fen, uh, let's go. <laughs> you know that that really crap skill that you keep yeah, banging on about. It is, it is garbage. I'm so <laughs> totally garbage. <laughs> you I can mean, even my, put uh, the stand firm in as well, right? You can just have a full three. Man yeah, yeah. Come. You got so many feed dwarfs. Yeah. I would like to keep like those two tagged, the thrower and the other line only. Though. I'd like to put something in between those. Yeah, you can. I mean, you can still, like this, the the guard, the stand firm can go there. Well, yeah, and then he can go there, and you still got two guys to put nope. on both of these. Right, can be okay. No, I would have liked both of these. Yeah, I would have liked. Yeah, it's even making a as well, yeah, You don't want him free, do you? I think. No, not when he's got no, not when he's got no dodge on. Them. Yeah. Leaping hobos. It was incredible. Anything that makes Elion's life difficult is incredible. <laughs> Jimmy, <laughs> you're incredible. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> this is uh, why I enjoyed it so much. <laughs> is Fen the most overrated, underrated skill? I don't think it's underrated. I think it's rated exactly correctly. Uh, Th those questions are always hard, right? Because, like, who, who is rating this, you know? Like, uh, I yeah. Know, yeah. I don't yeah. mind Fend, but I, I rarely take it. It's, it's like, fourth, maybe, well, probably fifth, maybe fourth at a push skill on a ghoul or something like that. But, uh, I mean, like, a stat will just throw that out of whack, and then I probably won't ever take it. Yeah. It's funny. I don't really play it that well, so. Yeah. Yeah, it's funny, right? Because I think uh, someone said, "What do you think the most underrated skill is?" And my answer was guard, because yeah, because of how good it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even though everyone thinks it's brilliant, <laughs> it's still probably the most underrated skill. I, I would say, I would say, like out of like the newer players, I'd say stand firm is probably the most underrated. Like, but that's because I don't think like they know about it as much. Whereas, mm. like, obviously, it's not underrated with good like experienced coaches but yeah exactly it depends on like what the population of people who are rating the thing is right yeah like, yeah. like school says considering people have said that it made peasants better than zombies it's probably overrated <laughs> but hang on which people yeah not 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 all the people will say that yeah <laughs> <laughs> some, some people maybe <laughs> i mean the reason peasants are better than, well no i don't even know if peasants are better than zombies not <laughs> they're, they're like movement five, which is a plus. Six, but... movement six. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. But yeah, they are Oof, maybe cool. seven, which is. <laughs> yeah, terrible. it's not what you want in lino, is it? Is the thing. No. And it's yeah, because I always put my blockers on the line. They always die. Mm. What's it? What's happening here? He's thinking about the apple. He decides no. Really? Jesus. He could have appled it. Like there's no, there's not that you born there. I think I, I think I would have apoed it. Like, yeah. yeah. I don't think he has to. He's in a decent enough position, isn't he? Is he? Maybe. What? he's he's got plenty of time, right? He's on yeah, the halfway I've been line. But he's, he, now he's outnumbered, right? Now, now it's nine versus uh, nine versus ten. Yeah, true, true, true. Like I, yeah. I'd have probably apoed it. I would sure. have apoed it. Yeah. But yeah, I can understand it... not apoing it. Yeah. yeah. Because if, if like something dies and he apos it and it survives, but then the team loses, then it doesn't matter, does it? Like it's and it's still like it's early enough in the half, right? On turn ten, like it's still early enough to get value out of the actual saving the KO. Yeah, yeah a lot of value, yeah. Because like his best That's... case scenario now is overtime. So and and it might he might only be oh no, he, if he gets to overtime, he gets two chances. So it is seventy five percent to come back for overtime. And like you know how he left all those guys like lying free on the floor, and now they're in the way. Yeah, yeah, uh, I didn't like them leaving them all free. Uh, yeah, I remember doing that, and I think it was either Shawnee or someone were like, "Yeah, you need to really tag the guys that are on the floor." And I was like, "All oh, right, cheers." 
Cheers, big ears. Sean has not got big ears, has he? No, it's just a thing to say, isn't it? Oh. Uh, or do you only say cheers, big ears to people with big ears? Normally, yeah. Mm, I'd like, just say then it, it's more offensive, isn't it? Which <laughs> <laughs> means it's funnier. <laughs> <laughs> I just generally say cheers, big ears. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You've never heard cheers, big ears, Wolfbug, aren't you British? I've only yeah, heard it I've... on this channel. I think uh, I think Wolf Bark's like southern as well. You mm. don't sound like northern, which is like I've heard it. Yeah, that's no, a northeast thing. Says oh, is it? I don't think it is. I don't think that is at all. We say it in Essex. Mm. Mind you, they say a lot of shit. In Essex. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. Maybe it's Devon. just an old. Maybe it's just an old people thing. Cheers, Medeas is the one. I guess, one I guess we, we actually qualify as old people now. <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Well, well, <laughs> steady on, speak for yourself. You're like in your thirties, aren't you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, oh, I look. Oh, just. <laughs> <laughs> what you, you what? <laughs> what do you say, Divi? I said I look younger than you. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, <laughs> just wait till I shave. <laughs> <laughs> Have we ever Wait, seen I a clean-shaven Elliot? <laughs> it's Mr. Burns, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Mate, I only found out. I only found out yesterday or the day before that I was uh, younger than Space. I was gobsmacked. I was like, really? <laughs> Dominic Diamond Elliot. <laughs> Dominic Diamond. It's oh, is he the guy? Is he the guy who used to be a burglar and now he helps people put security in their houses? No, he he, he presented that thing. Fucking what was it called? Game, um, game thing. Uh. Game Games Master. Yeah. Oh, that was brilliant. I used to love that. <laughs> yeah, so did I. I, I only the... know about it from the last time that Ali compared me to Dominic Diamond. <laughs> well, the monocle is it? Is it got a monocle? <laughs> no, no, that was that was uh, fucking oh. That was like the the astrologer, wasn't it? Dominic Diamond was the oh Patrick uh, Patrick O'More or Patrick Patrick, Patrick Moore. Moore yeah Patrick Moore yeah oh, Dominic well, Diamond was the idiot presenter. <laughs> uh, Rupee's got himself in a bit of trouble. Yeah, not not too much actually. To be fair, no. yeah. I mean, I mean, the odds have put him in a bit of trouble. To be fair, yeah. like, like they've come in pretty heavy. Level up needs to uh, shut this right side down a bit, I think. They're coming hard. Mmm. Uh, but yeah, he just wants to get his elves in front of the chores, I guess. Yeah. He's got one man, one more man now. I mean, it depends on... Oh, I just it, misspoke Thule and you dick. Oh, he's, he's, he's <laughs> going to... Sorry, go on, Debbie. I was just going to... It looks like he's going to punch with a guard guy. I'd be dodging him out to make the screen on the right. Yeah, I don't know, because there's two ways to go about, right? You can screen, but also, with this man advantage and these blood steppers, you could just go all in here, right? You could even tag the chorfs up, go full contact, and, and end up with this big blood step man on the... Oh, is he not sidestep? No, he is sidestep. This big blood step man on the ball being a right problem for the chorfs to deal with. Yeah. Yeah, I think you'd definitely go for the hit and just fish for the pow. And then, yeah, the pow looks nice, doesn't it? Yeah, I guess, yeah, because then, yeah, because if he moves that Lino Elf across one, then he can't blitz oh, the big sidestepper. Oh, yeah, I, I don't mind this at all, to be honest. I, the only thing is, he's got a couple of Elves that aren't tagging people up, you know, because he's, like, taking the hit and stuff like that, but, but yeah, I kind of like it. I, I, don't, I don't like this one. I think if if you're in all-in, you know, if you've powered him, yeah, and yeah. you're all-in then, but at the moment, this is just to stand up and power this guy, isn't it? Well, I was expecting him to tag up with these last three elves as well, which is not really done. Yeah, yeah and the thing oh, is, you, you can't foul, tag him. You can't tag him, though. So whatever you do with everybody, he stands up and he blitzes, right? And then you've got, no matter he what did. you had with everyone yeah, else, you had, you had true, some players. Yeah, I don't know about this. I, I Like, he could just lose half his team this turn. <laughs> like, yeah. I mean, to be, really. to be fair, he's, he's lost, like, pretty much nothing after 11, so he probably thinks it's fine. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, cheeky foul. There was there was no oh, foul possible. Oh yeah, he could have fouled. He could have fouled. Yeah, he couldn't get to the club on the fouling. Yeah, he's a bit of a half man. So. Oh, oh, he doesn't power him. Oh no, he's sorry, he's not sized up. I thought it was a blitzer. 
Oh, that. Uh... No, I th when you said the size of it, I thought you meant this guy. So I thought, I thought it. So you fish for the pal, so that you can put the blood stepper on him, right? Yeah, that, that would be good. Yeah. That was my thinking when you mentioned him, but yeah. Yeah, I just mistakenly thought that guy was a blitzer. Oh yeah, if this guy was a, if this guy was a blitzer, then yeah, no. definitely I'd have gone for the money. Yeah. Yeah. Because he hasn't got the hair color scheme, has he? That's what it is. No. Yeah. Cool. You, you need the hair color scheme to uh, differentiate the players. Yeah. Could you foul him though? Like how? Like run all the way around and foul from here? I don't know if you could get there because there was a screen, wasn't there? So he could, you'd have to dodge in to foul. This no wizard. Yeah, I think there's no wizard. A little no. rough. Here. Oh, he's <laughs> dub scold again! Oh my god! Is he? Oh my god, he is completely in. Is he? How can you see that? Hilarious. Hey! <laughs> hey. <laughs> oh, wow. This is one of the things, right, about the new 2020 rules. Yeah. Because it's horrible when you roll that early double skull and you've got to protect the ball because you know that you're exposed and then, that, you know, if new rules, he's not exposed. But by the same token, scat the oh wow, he does have a Wait, wizard. What? It didn't show oh, up. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. He did have a wizard. I did think it was weird that he only had a bribe. But yeah, yeah there wasn't even wizard. that wizard bug. There's usually a bug where it shows a blank space, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, exactly, yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it's... it's is level up French, is he? <laughs> <laughs> Banter! <laughs> He's just got an admin wizard. Wow. Wow. Ninja wizard is, is just too far. Oh, right. Well, in that case, yeah, he was in a lot of trouble, wasn't he? Yeah, oh, he absolutely dire space, yeah. Yeah, I mean, you definitely base up then because that's horrendous. I don't think that's a wizard. It's just gods on his side. <laughs> Holy moly. That is brutal. That is brutal, isn't it? That is almost... It's almost over. Oh, we'll go that far, Chief. I mean, I wouldn't say it's over. Don't say it's over. <laughs> no, it's... Um... <laughs> Pretty, pretty goddamn close, isn't it? Oh, shall I ban him, Jim? Shall I ban Elliot? <laughs> no. I mean, you could, because he's not going to write in chat right now. <laughs> I banned you from Daedal's chat today, do you? Just FYI. I'm a mod. Oh, no, I'm not. Why did you ban I wasn't even in Daedal's chat today. Well, Daedal made me a mod, so obviously first action. <laughs> <laughs> Say <Safe> who's first. <laughs> So I, I only I only go to Daedal's stream to watch uh, to listen to Seagull. I, I, was, I was I was in there. I did have a work day this week, so I was in there for ages. And the seagulls are amazing. Yeah, <laughs> it was yeah amazing. It's, it's really calming. It's like, yeah, it is. It's really calm. Yeah. I, I literally thought he was doing it on purpose when I first heard it. Like, yeah, I thought he was SFX. I was like, oh, he's playing like because you know he plays like Lord of the Rings music and that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I thought his new thing was ambient seagull noises. <laughs> yeah, well, thing he had, it, didn't he? Mr. Page, when he was streaming Storybook Brawl, he had like ambient, ambient bird song on all the time, didn't he? Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. That's what I mean. So yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't too ridiculous. <laughs> they are real seagulls, yes, Wolfpack. Yeah. yeah. Like they're in his house, apparently. They are really loud. It's like he's especially designed to pick up seagulls. He has a he has a nest on his, on his roof. Oh, man. Lesbian seagull by Engelbert Humperdinck. Really? Yeah, they're clearly, clearly not endangered in Sweden. Yeah, this looks terrible for creepy now. How can you hear anything over all the mouse clicks? <laughs> the sound of breaking desks and keyboards. Hey, like it's just like when he chats, like when he does the in-game type in chat, and it's just pages of text. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the hammering like... of the keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> Glorious. No offense, Daedal, of course. Oh no, I love Daedal. It's hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> He's under attack. Daedal, Daedal's pretty much like what I am when I'm not streaming and if I play Blood Bowl, which isn't like ever, like I've probably played 10 games off stream, like, and I am uh, way more toxic off stream than I am on stream, <laughs> but <laughs> I'm pretty toxic on stream to be fair. <laughs> yeah. yeah. 
I mean, to be fair, to be fair, PC, the mouse was already broken and I'd already ordered the replacement. So I did it for comedic effect. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, I remember that. Yeah. It looked like um, one of the uh, house robots. <laughs> yeah, it did. <laughs> oh, dear, well, it, it, this is bad, isn't it? This is real bad. How do you, what really do you bad. do this? Yeah. Uh, get the ball back. I guess. I guess. I don't know. Yeah. Well, he doesn't even need to come forward. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's not oh, blitzed yet. Yeah, okay. Yeah, oh. Yeah, so, oh, yeah, so maybe he should have dodged right because he he hadn't he hadn't popped uh, dodge or break tackle on the initial dodge. So maybe he could have double dodged it. I don't know why the chorf hasn't moved yet. Well, you can hit the ball. Mm. Yeah, he's got break tackle and he hadn't popped dodge or thing. And then if he goes there, maybe he could. I don't know. Did it? Did you just head off and score or what? Could do, couldn't he? Uh, it's not a catcher, he needs a GFI, doesn't he? Yeah, he does need the GFI, so probably not. Well, you just cage it, can't you? Yeah. Just take it with the pitch and cage it. Yeah, definitely not. Just, just cage. Even if he's actually he's got a hell of a long way to go. Yeah, yeah, it's absolutely silly to give him the one thirty-six chance. Well, I remember a very, a very insightful commentator um, saying this game was over on like turn five or something. Do you remember that? <laughs> no, D Dimmy hadn't joined us by then. Hey. Also, I didn't know the wizard was in play. <laughs> it would have been even play. more over if the wizard was in play. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was weird though, because it's not like how it normally looks with a bug, is it? Like, uh, yeah, you know? yeah, exactly. Yeah. It was a super surprise wizard. Wow, in like, in the chore favour, Wolfbark? Yeah, it wasn't this way, yeah, exactly, yeah, like, the the elves aren't exciting, are they? Like, they've got they've got a movement guy, sure. They, they've high-rolled the attrition pretty pretty massively, haven't they, to yes. be fair? They've been pretty damn lucky. Yes. And the Blitz, of course, as well. <laughs> yeah. This is Level Up's first chalice as well, and he's like, he's smashing his way into round three, isn't he? Yeah. It sure looks like it. And with, like, well, I don't want to say it yet, but yeah, well, with a healthy team. Oh, there you go. Elliot had the exact same thought. <laughs> right. So, yeah, first chance. Great nine. And through the round three. I mean, I knew that before I asked. I was just asking. For stuff, you know. oh, give me the pro champ. <coughs> oh, he's looked on numbers. Ah. Yeah, he's American. I asked him if he was Welsh, he said no. Why did you ask you if he was Welsh? Because there was that geezer on One World One Blood Bowl one time, wasn't it? Oh, yes. And his no, name, no number or something. Yeah, yeah and I okay. thought it, no number. I thought it was him. And I, I yeah, said, because okay. he was in Dadle's chat, and I just went, uh, did you sit next to me like at UKT? <laughs> and he was like, no, I'm American. I was like, oh, right. Oh. I have nothing else to say. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, I thought it was him. Is that is no number uh, a reference to something that I don't know about? Um, yeah, he's a nice little Yoshi. Yeah, yeah, he sat. I think I can't remember who he played against. I think he played against Necronome, so he was sat next to me. So I was playing against Gab. Think, and uh, he was next to me, and Necronome beat him. <laughs> yeah, uh, the Proves have played uh, played pretty well, I think. Yeah, I mean, the Chorves have played fine. It's uh, just been a, a pretty brutal one for them, to be fair. Yeah, it was pretty brutal, to be fair. But I, like I say, mate, like if you'd actually tagged the geezers on the floor and they couldn't run around in front of him, I think he might have had more options. Mm. 
Yeah, maybe. It's it's just, you know, uh, down players to elves with a wizard. <laughs> it's crazy. Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. The yeah, well be, yeah like, to be fair, we didn't... I, well, I, I wasn't aware there was a wizard at that point either. No, none of us were. Yeah. It, like, normally, it, there's a space when the wizard doesn't show up. And there was no space, so it just looked like they didn't have a wizard. Which was unusual that they wouldn't have a wizard. I thought, why has he got a prime instead of a wizard? Couldn't he have cut something and got a wizard? <laughs> it was a pretty weird thing to do, and like the team looked a lot worse. So it looked like he wouldn't be able to get one anyway. Just bag it in now, don't you? Yeah. Make it, uh... Defending the ball. How many SPP? How many SPP is he on? That that Kaiser. We gonna throw a pass here? Vanity pass? No. <laughs> <laughs> I was joking. I mean, that. Rick would. Yeah. Uh. Rick would. My ability to win chalice is is absolutely dependent on this one extra SPP. <laughs> yeah. Oh, or even I'm levels like, him anyway. And the, to be fair, the completion would have leveled him. <laughs> yeah. Uh, for, for a pass, man. And the, and the touchdown would have leveled the blitzer. So yeah, Rick oh totally God. would have passed it. Oh my God! Yeah, I guess good get Sure, feet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and it might have been the right play actually. Right. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Well, I called it. You know. Yeah, because you're still probably going to win it 2-1, right? There was um, there was the game versus Mo Plovac, right? Rick Rick's Amazons versus Mo Plovac versus Kemri, and uh, he that did was some horrendous. No, it was not. I would have done that all day long. I mm -hmm. absolutely agree with Rick there, and it, it worked out really badly. <laughs> you know, when he won in ninety. Really badly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But, I mean, in the end, he worked out fine. He got the score, but. But, uh, but yeah, it was absolutely the play to go for. There was one ages ago where he did it with a ghoul against some vampires. Uh, yeah, I remember he, that he, one. He, that, remember that was that a one. massive throw. <laughs> that was horrible. <laughs> but yeah, the, the one against the, the Kemri I would have gone for all day long, yeah. I, I, yeah, I like, remember that one vividly. Yeah, yeah that one was that, was that was my first exposure to the true levels of Rick. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I remember when he when he was it was like you know the first or second day of the season, very early in the season, and he was playing lizard men. And oh my god, I remember this as well. <laughs> yeah, he like had five. He played literally five games and like drew drew them oh, all. Oh, yeah. He was just trying to level this like Saurus, and it's like <laughs> he could have just won them all. And like, yeah, I, I remember, I remember you commenting like you know commenting on it. Yeah. yeah. You could have had a five and all lizard man team with loads of SPPs on Saurus. <laughs> like he would have still got there. But instead he had a zero zero one. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, just winning is, is 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 fine, isn't it? Like just guaranteed winning is pretty good. Yeah, yeah. I am never gonna hate on you know on uh, not doing the passes and stuff. And like it's protecting your players as well because if you go for that pass and you fail it and then you you move nine gets claw palmed and he's dead then you like yeah. feel it here, yeah. don't you? Like especially Elliot would be like, oh my god, why did I do that? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I don't know. I don't he, know. He would be dishing out bands left, right, and centre. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Why? Why didn't I just take the guaranteed three? Uh, <laughs> no, no. I, I would, I would recognise. Yeah, I, I, I beat myself up for the for the terrible things I do, not the good things that, that uh, fail. Thanks, <laughs> Maybe sometimes. Thanks, yeah. thanks for the five gift sub bomb you banned because of <laughs> gift sub bomb. <laughs> Banned. Oh yeah, I got banned. I got banned for saying happy birthday to you in Elliot's chat. <laughs> Not by me, I should point out. <laughs> well, he's a representative. It's true. Of it's you. true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wait, if if I did anything like what, okay, Lord? Sorry, what's uh, <laughs> what? What is it? What is this? Yeah, what, is this? <laughs> what is this? I'll do anything. <laughs> <laughs> The shave! The, sh the shave was the best. Oh my god. It was so funny. He didn't need to reroll that, right? Because he could have taken the Fuck power off, and hit this uh, Yeah, but do does he have. Could he, could he do it that way, though? Like, he'd get the first hit, yeah. He could get the yeah, next yeah. hit, but could he get. He'd get one more hit as well, but could he get the last ah, hit? Okay, Not sure he'd get the last hit. Fair enough. Fair, fair enough. enough. Can he get it anyway, though? I guess is the other question. Yeah, it's a good question. Yeah, <laughs> he should have just banged all the elves. <laughs> it's it's not comedy, Ali. It's just bullying. <laughs> oh, 
do. Make a pass to get a level in Chalice. There you go. That's all you've got to do. Oh, yeah. Easy. Make it. Oh, my God. All right, then. Let's go. We're playing dwarfs this season. God damn it. But sure. <laughs> That was that was the best. That was the best. The, the like, the someone saying, "I'll give you a ten at a shave." And like, yeah, yeah, just yeah, dash yeah. us off. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I I thought the mustache was horrible. Yeah, I had a shave done all day long. <laughs> <laughs> he was gone. <laughs> it was hilarious. Just instantly. <sighs> yeah, I think he's not going to get this, is he? Like, I don't think. Nope. He's gonna get uh, no, he can't fill really, can he? Can't fill the squares. Oh, it'd be hilarious if that Lino just runs down and scores. Pushes, there, scores. <laughs> pushes there to there, and then he's got two more, so he goes around and he dodges. So yeah, it, it's possible. It's is possible. it? Is it? Can he? Fuck off, Jimmy! Oh, he's got an extra hobble as well. I didn't even realise that yeah, guy was free. Yeah, I thought that was the ball guy. No, he's not doing it, but it was possible. Like you would need a full oh. dodge, but it was possible. Why is he not doing yes. it? Okay. No, I won't give in. I don't know. Until I'm victorious, oh. and I will defend. Yeah, but he could have done it with the twelve dodge. And it's the yeah. only way. He, it's the only way he draws, right? Yeah. So he should have done it, even though he needed a four plus dodge. Oh yeah, for, for some reason I thought it was turn sixteen and he was two one down, but it's turn fifteen <laughs> and he's three one down. Okay. Yeah, yeah, like it's still not gonna. He still, he was still lost. Like it was still over. Yeah, lost, yeah. Really, but yeah, he could have given himself a technical. A technical chance. Uh, yeah, it's better him. than no chance. Yep, yep. Squig on a stick, one whole year. Thank you very much for staying fantastic. Absolutely glorious. Hey, then he double ones the pickup. Amazing. He's doing a sage one turn, yeah. <laughs> the sage one turn has got to be one of the funniest. One of the funniest YouTube videos ever. The title is just like movement seven one turn, <laughs> you know, <laughs> and he, the guy's movement six. <laughs> he, he doesn't score. <laughs> That's pretty amazing. <laughs> <laughs> the two key details of the title are both are false. <laughs> amazing. But yeah, yeah, just scoring on him. It is good that it. Definitely stops these guys getting punched, doesn't it? Like that's the main thing. Like even it, if you it, blitz first, you could quad skull and die. And even if you screen them, you know, and you, you do before you do the pass, they, someone could get claw on. So yeah, I, I do like just banging it in, honestly. They they could, and but at the end of the day, it's all about the average, right? You know, like yes, that could happen, but it's very low odds, and you are very high odds to level them, right? And they could be two pretty good skills. Mm. So don't get me wrong, I I, I definitely be erring on the side of just scoring. But you know, probably Rick doing that pass there would probably be right. I think. Yes, it probably would be. Yeah, uh, it probably would be correct. For chalice equity. Also, it depends mm. on the next opponent as well, doesn't it? Like... True. Yeah. True. Yeah. I don't know, Armour China, he's, uh, he's had problems though. Don't really wanna, don't really wanna take the piss out of his YouTube videos, but it was funny. <laughs> Did you say he's got heart problems? Not heart problems, he has had problems. Oh, sorry. Just your, uh... There you go, oh. this guy just died. Have you got an apo? Oh, oh no, it worked. <clears throat> Yeah, mental health. Problems. Speak of the devil. How oh. old, Rick? Um, well, we can do. We could do claw after this game. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you're finished. Yeah, we'll just do claw after this. There's one more match, but it's probably going on right now. So probably just do claw now, and then the replay after. Ask questions later. <laughs> yeah. It's a glorious commentary team, isn't it? And Dimmy. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget oh me, God. guys. <laughs> Fuck off, Dimmy. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers, sandwich. Uh, nine o'clock, little Yoshi, so, you know, very soon. You've timed it pretty pretty well, I would say. 
I mean, you didn't time anything, did you, Jim? It's just level up and groupy. I mean, yeah. <laughs> but... <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, what is claw time? Um, you don't know. You don't know claw. Oh my god, where have you been, little Yoshi? What rock have you been living under? Monday yeah, Night Claw it's... is the best TV show in the world. Uh, well, Every Twitch Tuesday. Uh, what? <laughs> Every Monday. Every... Oh, is it Monday now, is it? <laughs> yes. Monday oh, right. Night Claw, Friday Night Stand Firm, the JFW, and it is glorious. Anyway, let's get back to this. Uh, commiserations, Krippy, congratulations, level up or look no numbers, whichever you prefer. Um, that was crazy, wasn't it? And uh, thank you very much, Dimi and Elliot. Glorious having you both on. Thank you so much. Yep. And... <laughs> Um, thanks for watching everyone, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.